Hi! In the next few minutes, we'll take a look at some of the highlights in the latest release of OpenText Application Quality Management. First up, Aviator, the generative AI assistant designed to boost your productivity. Use Aviator to provide suggestions on creating manual tests for requirements. In just a few clicks, the suggested tests are automatically created for you. Next, Web Client Updates. You can now add parameters to your manual tests and run the same test multiple times with different data. This can increase both flexibility and efficiency in your testing process. The Dashboard module in Web Client is now equipped with more functionality. You can create, edit, and organize dashboards. This release includes the following usability enhancements. You can share an entity by copying its URL or by sending by email. User fields show both usernames and full names, making it easier to select the right users. From the details window of an entity, you can more easily navigate to the previous, next, first, or last entity in the grid. You can update multiple manual tests in a single action. Next, Web Client Workflow. The Global Object TD Connection is now available. You can use it in any event from any module to access almost all Web Client functionality. In addition, you can initialize custom actions by creating a custom button. The button can be added to the toolbar of a Web Client module or to the Manual Runner window. Test planning in Desktop Client has become more efficient. You can export tests, along with their design steps, to Excel. Moving on to Project Report Updates. You can now download project reports as zip packages. This allows sharing with external users and viewing report attachments offline. Using parameters, you can control the display size of embedded images and PDF reports and reduce DOCX report size by adjusting the image compression level. Finally, the admin report now comes with additional metrics. It provides site admins with more insights into site-level activities, including project repository size and inactive project users. Check out the Help Center to learn more and enjoy the new release.